So she says, radiallahu anha, Umm Salama, the great woman, I asked, O oh, Messenger of God, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, will you not teach me a special prayer that I can supplicate with? Give me a dua that I can say that will guarantee me safe passage. And the Prophet ﷺ replied, Indeed, say, O oh God, the Lord of the Prophet Muhammad, forgive my sins. Remove the rage in my heart and protect me from misguided tribulations so long as you allow me to live. Uh, o oh God, Rabbi Muhammad, the Lord of Muhammad. Don't miss that point out. Because that point, that part of the dua is very important. The nisbah to the Rasul wasallam. Ighfir them, forgive my sins. Yani, remove the rage in my heart. Okay? What's called ghayr, ghayr qalbi. Remove the ghayr from my heart. Wajirnin min mudillat al fitan. And protect me from the misguiding tribulation so long as you allow me to live. Hadith in the Mustad of Ahmed ibn Hanbal. This dua is very, very important. We should constantly say both of them. The dua of the Prophet sallallahu and the one that he taught Um Salama. And what he taught Um Salama, our teachers say that it's especially important for women to say, especially important for women. And of the great Imams of the last generation, his name is Habib Abdul Qadir al Saqqaf. Rahmatullah ta'ala alayhim, who died only two years ago, radiallahu anhu. He said that in a gathering amongst Imams, they, he said that any woman who says this dua, takes out the word consistently, she will reach the highest levels of spirituality. Aqtab, the way to use. She become min al-aqtab, the highest levels of spiritual purification. Somebody in the, in the gathering shouted out to him, Ya Abdul Qadir, Abdul Qadir, you know what you're saying? You understand what you're saying? That just from a dua here, she'll get to the highest levels of purity? He said, I understand exactly what I'm saying. That's what he said, exactly what I'm saying. Huh? That's a very, very special, very powerful, very potent, this prayer. And nobody should be bereft of knowledge of it. And nobody should be, should be bereft of acting in accordance with it. We ask Allah Ta'ala for tawfiq minhu. Remember the act that is upon your tongue. The act that is inside of your heart. Minhu. La mink. It's from him, not from you. Just expose yourself, huh? Expose yourself to it. Kasb. Laha ma kasabat. You will get whatever you've earned, which is for you. And it's against you, ma kasabat. That which you're going to find difficult to do. And the Baqarah, which you recited every night. No. Um, and you hear the dua in Arabic, the dua of Salama, the last one. And he, Allahumma, and he, Allah, where is the dua? By myself. Allahumma, Rabbi, Rabbi Nabi Muhammad, Allahumma, Rabbi Nabi Muhammad, Ikhfir Dambi. يعني أذهب غي أذهب عني غيظ قلبي أذهب عني غيظ قلبي أذهب عني غيظ قلبي وأجرني من مضلات الفتن وأجرني من مضلات الفتن وأجرني من مضلات الفتن ما دمت حيا ما دمت حيا Allahumma ya Rabbi, ya, ya Rabbi Nabi Muhammad, athib anni ghayd qalbi wa jirni min mudillat al-fitan, ma dumtu hayya. Naam.